Welcome to this video. It's Sedaka. Sedaka 26. And I never played this guy. From Israel. Very high rating. 2569. Let's see. Does he have a name? E.M. Gabriel Batang Batalini from France. Okay. So he played G3 against the. Nimzo. And, uh, let's see if I'm able to remember my own recommendation from the book. Queen b6. Hmm. Yeah, this was one one line. Hmm. Three. Okay, let's see. I just hope to harass him a bit provoking weaknesses if possible yeah but in fact rook c1 is a is a normal move okay it's not it's not a big problem i am always able to return to a hedgehog With bishop e7, d6, and so on. But, um, at least this keeps him irritated for for the moment. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see. Rook d8. And then maybe retreat later, and then d6. f4 f5 this is sometimes an idea I'm not sure that um, it's valid exactly in this position uh, no it doesn't look like it May, maybe i'm even able to play b5 this is in fact interesting i mean it's not clear that i need to resort Ah, that's an interesting move. I don't understand it, but it's interesting. Queen takes, what is your point? Rook, I can, I can get all the pawns. Hmm. I don't understand what he's doing. Rook a1, queen b3. I can always take c4. I can can eat all the pawns. I don't understand it. What I'm a bit cautious about, look at my pieces, yeah? Rook d8 undefended, b8 undefended, knight undefended. This is... Um, the well-known John Nunn line, loose pieces drop off and uh, therefore I'm a bit cautious but I don't see how he would engineer any attacks on those pieces. Knight d uh, queen, queen d4, I want to attack the knight, I can just go back to c6 or to g6 even. Yeah, probably, uh, wait, 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 uh, wait. Knight c6. He can maybe take and play queen a7. I have afraid have rook b have rook the rook move. Yeah. And then this is just good. Attacking the queen. Okay. So now b3 hangs so. No, but I don't really, I don't really need to take it, and it's uh, it's tricky. Rook b1 or whatever, I can just go back here. This a3 pawn is uh, <laughs> just um, something that I should should take and be happy with. <laughs> okay, let's see d5, maybe knight g5. Okay, I'll drop back here. He can play knight d6, but this is not not the perfect blockade. I can play here. 
and um, maybe just take it. I have a5, I have b5, various ways to, to attack it. Let's check b5. The queen doesn't really have squares. Well, it's still, it's still okay, probably. Everything else fails. I go queen a5 to c7. And, uh, consolidate. Hmm, queen. Hmm, what's the idea? Knight h5 or something. Oh. Okay, I'll go. I'll uh, follow their plan. Wow. Okay. Yeah, this is the kind of stuff that the computer laughs at afterwards, but it's not easy. Not easy to defend. Should be four, maybe I don't know. Yeah, it's uh, not so not so clear cut. My queen is uh, far off. This is um, the typical problem of um, many attacks that the defending queen is away. C6 could be could be a big problem. <clears throat> Something like that. Intending C7. And I'm not sure I can take it. Yeah, this is a very simple move, but <clears throat> maybe good a good one. Hmm. It's not threatening a maid though. I always have E7 to escape. Check. I'm threatening rook h8 winning and I don't see he must play something he does not want to play bishop retreat or something yeah yeah well uh, this is just winning now but I can always blunder it, of course. Mm, yeah, come on, let's keep it simple. This uh, makes the position much more Yeah, easier to play. And um, I'm ahead on the clock. Check. 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 White resigns. Yeah, I don't think this was working, really, the sacrifice. Maybe I'm wrong, but it's, um, yeah, hard to say. A man around here, I'm, 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 I'm a pawn up. He needs to do something.
drastic. And um, yeah, the comps has wide wins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The the queen, the queen. There is there is something queen. Check. Queen h5. This is what he did. And what what is winning here? Rook d6 is winning. Yeah, this is winning. I'm not quite sure why. What is this move actually doing? Ninety six. Yeah, he's right to me. What's the threat? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Rooks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, trickier. Yeah. What? Uh, how does it continue? The comp wants to play rook b7, and then gives check. me check, and then this one. Yeah, maybe just threatening knight e6 and then c6 and stuff. I'm I'm all tied up here. I don't have I don't have any move. So this means um, I should have uh, played differently. I mean, I'm pretty sure that uh, I'm just I'm just an excellent shape in this position. Just need to be precise, and um, yeah, pre I, uh, probably this one. I, I played I played this move. I must probably play d6, pre preventing c5 and and those ideas. The queen is also controlling g5. Yeah, this is excellent. I'm already a pawn up, and it's an important pawn that uh, keeps the queen side together. So the structure is also excellent. Yeah, this is this is probably right. Or instead of the queen move, there was this, and then d6, getting to the headshot. But um, I'm already um, a pawn up. This a3 pawn. Yeah, but he, he he got to a very dangerous attack. In fact, a winning attack. So knight f7 was a nice Check. find. I was underestimating this, and uh, it's still winning. Funny enough. Check. Four wins, but queen h7 is the queen h7. Check. Funny enough, uh, spoils it completely to, and gives black the better game. Okay, rook d4 is a draw. <laughs> yeah, rook d4, f4, typical computer chess. He did this, and now it's uh, it's gone. Yeah, this is just the easiest. Mopping up the game with the two bishops uh, raging across the board. All right, an interesting game. Thanks for watching.